much there already. What's up guys? It's Danielle here, back with another video. It's Halloween. It might not be Halloween when I post this, so it's not Halloween. Happy late Halloween. We're doing a get ready with me. I have to shower and do my makeup. We're gonna be showing you guys what we are, and it's actually a big surprise. So if you want to see what it is, keep watching. But without further ado, let's get on with the video. I'm getting in the shower, and then I'm gonna have my to go down my hair. Out of the shower and right now I'm just trying to take off my makeup. It takes forever to take it off. So and Mikey's gonna blow dry my hair. Um, you guys so my makeup's all off now, so I'm gonna get started. I think I kind of want to do more of like a full glam look because it's Halloween, so we want to go all out. Should I do full glam? Yeah. Yeah. Full glam, no glam, really natural. I do my brows first, no matter what situation it is. The brows are the best part, and they take the longest. He's gonna go get my brow gel for me because it's downstairs. Right now, I'm kind of taking some of the brow gel off of my brush because if you guys know how Anastasia did brow is, it gets all chunky and nasty if you leave it on your brush. So I'm just trying to take a little bit of that off so my brows are nice and stiff tonight. If you are looking for some good brow products, let me just tell you, Anastasia Dip Brow is the best brow gel, but definitely Benefit Cosmetics, the best brow anything. They have everything you can freaking imagine for brows. They're so good. Oh, thank you, baby. So, I'm gonna do my brows really quick and he's gonna go down my hair. Okay, so I finished this brow. I still have to carve it, but I'm gonna do the next brow. But I'm just using the benefit for like the top part up here, and I'm just kind of like making like a little bit of lines, and then I go in with the Anastasia Dip Brow. So I made it. I don't use this every day, but just because I want my eyebrows to be super bold. Thicker, not full. <laughs> You're gonna make me mess up. You see that thing is looking good? Mm -hmm. So right now I'm done with both brows. You can't really see them that well. I'll show you when they're fully done. So I'm just gonna carve them out right now. Okay guys, I finished doing her hair. Not fully, but like. My brows are done. Ew, I like this is good. So my brows are done. So right now I'm going to do on makeup. Probably just gonna do um, something super simple, not too much. I don't wanna be like super, super dramatic cause I'm not being something scary. I'm being something like funny. We're just gonna like put concealer on your eye to set it. Also, I don't use primer for my eyelids because I don't think it does anything. So after that, I just go in with a powder, like a regular powder, and I just kind of set my eyes with a super like light 
proud of this. All right, so I'm gonna look for some eye makeup to do. I'm not really sure what colors I'm gonna do yet. But I think I'm gonna use my Soft Glam by Anastasia because there's a lot of cute like oranges and reds in it. I think I'm gonna go with orange soda. Orange soda as just a transition shade. It's a super like light orange. So it's just gonna give me some definition to my eye. I wanna do like a glittery eye, but not super, super glittery, but like glittery. So, okay, so there's my transition shade. Um, it's just super natural. I'm falling. So now I'm gonna go in with burnt orange, which is just a little bit, it says burnt, it's just a little bit darker than the um, orange. So I'm just gonna put that in my, the corner of my eye right there. And then that just makes it like a little bit darker. And I'm gonna do the same to the other part of the eye. I love the names for the eyeshadows, like burnt orange, orange soda, like these are so cute. So I'm gonna take this Sigma brush and this is the E45. And I'm gonna take this um, rustic for like dark brown and I'm just also gonna put that on the crease. Okay, so I have like most of the eye makeup done. I'm debating if I should keep this orangey color or if I should make it a little bit darker. So this is the palette. This is from um, Profusion and it's actually one of my favorites. I'm gonna take Outspoken. It's kind of like a red color. And I'm gonna put that on my eye. Just in the corner a little bit. Just add some red to it because we love red. Tell me how to look cute. I'm gonna go into the color dull and just put it on the outside because it's super light and it just makes it to blend things out easily. All right, so I'm just taking this fluffy brush to blend it all out. So it's just like all blending. So I'm gonna do glitter. I need to find a glitter color that I wanna do though. Okay, so I have so many glitters, but these I just got sent to me by this company. They're super pretty. This might be pretty. So this is what I'm gonna do. Um, I have this one right here. All right, so um, this is how it's gonna look. Super, super neat for that first. I want to listen to music, but I don't want to get copyrighted. All right, so I'm just kind of like packing this glitter on. It looks really pretty, I like it. It's more of like a silvery, but I think once I mix it in with the gold, it will look really pretty. This glitter is like, it's okay, but I'm gonna go over with like another glitter so it's even like better. So I'm taking the shade bronze and I'm just putting that like over the gold. And it's making it actually like really pretty, so I'm glad that I made this decision. All right, so yeah, that looks so much prettier. I like actually like really like it now. I think it looks really cool. My glitter is done. I know it kind of looks weird right now. So what I do when I do my eyeliner is I draw a line right there, just going up, and then I do it on the other eye too. And usually my eyeliner is not this thick. But like I said, Halloween, you gotta go all out. I feel like Halloween is like the only night that you can go all out and like no one can say anything. All right, so here's my eyeliner on this side. All right, so I think that's done. Okay, so next I have to do primer. Um, I use this primer, it's Master Prime by Face Studio Maybelline. I put a lot. First things first, foundation, I'm gonna go in with the Maybelline 24 hour foundation. Um, this stuff is freaking bomb as heck. If you don't have it, get yourself some. All right, so I'm just gonna like, go like this with it. Oh, 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 oh. So I like to blend my foundation out with a brush because I feel like it does really nice. And then I go over it with a beauty blender. Blending, blending, we gotta blend that makeup out. Alrighty, so now it's time for working contour. So I'm gonna go into this shade right here. It's not super dark, but it's like dark. Right. You'll understand why I'm doing my makeup so extra this way when you're like. I like to do it this way. I don't know why, but. 
to charge but I'll be back to you guys soon um, I'm just doing concealer and then I'll be done so my makeup is done um, so now I just kind of kept it simple did a wing liner with some like glitter and I didn't put lashes on because I knew that I would get annoyed with them all night I'd be like <gasps> I need to take them off mm -hmm. when well, I'm I'm gonna be curling my hair hi right, guys so I'm just gonna kind of do a quick brush through my hair. Also, I'm gonna spray some heat protector. So, I'm pretty sure my curling iron is like heated up by now. And I don't like to do such little pieces when I curl my hair because I like my hair to be more wavy than like curly. So, I'm gonna take like this much hair and I'm just gonna curl it. I always mess up doing like the top piece of hair I'll come back to you guys when I'm done. Oh my gosh, they're not <laughs> Do you guys like it? Ooh. Playboy couple? Yeah, you did. So guys, this is our outfit. So we're Playboy couple. Rate my outfit from 1 to 10. Rate how my makeup looks. Rate how everything looks. I just wanted to let you guys see our little process of getting ready today. And we'll see you. My pipe broke. <laughs> okay.